Hello, and here we are. So we are finally here. I'm going to tilt the camera a little bit. We're finally here in Brussels. And look, 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 look at this. What do we see? We see a Christmas tree. So this Christmas tree, look at that. That is huge. And as you can see, the centre of Brussels Grand Place looks absolutely fantastic. We're just going to have a quick look around here. It's amazing when it's lit up. Let's have a quick switchy round the square. And there we are, back to the Christmas tree. And as you can see, it's very lively. I mean, what time is it? It's now midnight. It's midnight. midnight. And look how lively the square is at midnight. It's crazy. So we're pretty cold, aren't we? Yes. Not as it's not you know it's cold, but it's not freezing cold. Like I've got a little scarf on. I've got no jumper on. I've got like a vest top on. I've got a little scarf and I've got my gloves on. Um, and it's cold, but it's not that bitter cold. It's like that start of winter type cold, and that's quite unusual, I think, for December. But yeah, it's lovely. It's gorgeous. It's lit up. Everyone's out. You know, people just sitting around or just walking around. And there's that lovely tree. So, as I say, we are here. It's midnight. We've pretty much just got here. Slight little delay on the Eurostar for unforeseen circumstances. Okay, okay. So, do you want to? Do you want to tell us about our unforeseen circumstances? Um, so I'm very organised. Out of Mark and I, I'm the most organised one. And we go on lots of trips, as you know, from Mark and Kelly's trips, tips and things. And um, went to work and we were due to come here after work. We were booked on the um, six o'clock train to come to Brussels. And we left work early, got to the station, and then as we were walking to the um, departure, I realised I forgot my passport. Somebody forgot their passport, so some poor fool, i.e. me, has to go all the way back home and pick it up and come all the way back. Anyway, that said, we're here now, and look at this. This is absolutely fantastic. So, Grand Place, like I say, it's a very small city. A very small city Brussels so you can do the center around it in pretty much a day really but we just want to get a bit closer to the Christmas tree so you can have a look as you can see the people are gathering around getting their photos done but it's absolutely amazing and it's really big look at that and you can see that just next to the spire there and if you look behind you looking behind us <gasps> away in a manger Look at this. I'm just going to zoom in so you can see. So they've got a real nativity scene here. There you go. Baby Jesus, donkey, in the stable, in the manger. There we go. I've not seen this before. We've not come here Christmas time before, have we? Not come here for Christmas. No, we've come specifically for the Christmas market. So we were due to sort of arrive here around nine o'clock. Unfortunately, we got we uh, got off the, the train roughly about 20 to 11 because I then had to put us on a later train because, of course, I forgot my passport. Mark had to run home and get it while I sorted out our tickets to come on a later train. But we're here. It's lively, as you can see. The market has all been packed away, but tomorrow we will vlog the uh, Christmas market in Brussels. There you go. So I'll let you enjoy that Christmas tree one more time. There we are, and then we will say goodbye, enjoy our trip, and we will see you tomorrow. See you again on Mark and Kelly's trips, tips and things. Subscribe to our channel, comment, anything like that. Bye. Okay, bye.